FeatureCam 2018 can now automatically set the 5-axis position of your operations to avoid the translational and rotational limits of your machine tool. This option can use the axis limit set in your machine design file or from within the document itself to reduce your programming time. So as you can see I've loaded in the model and I've also loaded in the post processor file and what you can see is we've got a variety of different features all programmed on three different axis orientations. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to run through a machine simulation. Just single step in to get the view. And if I play this through, what you're going to see is we're going to hit an axis limit where the machine is trying to rotate past the limit of the machine itself. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to exit out of the simulation and I'm going to navigate into machining attributes. By displaying the milling properties, you can see we have this option to change the five axis position by default. So as you can see, it's currently set to standard. But what we have is this new option, which allows us to use the axis limits that have been defined. By selecting OK, because we set this in the machining attributes, this is filtered through into all three of our setups. If you don't want this to apply to the entire document, you can set this on the setup level, just by editing the setup and selecting the five axis position. Or you can set this feature by feature by navigating to the operation itself and selecting the five axis position. So at this point what I'm going to do, I'm going to run through the machine simulation again. Again, single step in to get my view. And if I just play this through, you'll see that we have no axis limits. And the part is machined successfully.